Oh, uh, 50. We're still doing 97. Let's go! Woo! 50. We're still 95. This is the power of AI. Woohoo! Just because of the automatic speed offset, I knew it's gonna do this right. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to another FSD beta video. So, we are headed back uh, from our test right over here. We did a roundabout test. If you haven't watched the video, I'll link it up on the top right. Um, yeah, FSD version 12 is doing really good. Um, roundabout test that passed everything except for one scenario where it has to get off from an exit. You can watch it on the video. Um, right now we're doing another test. I'm going on a new highway and on that highway the speed limits are not actually set properly because it was all under construction. So it, it used to bounce back all the way to version. Ooh, that was a big piece of ice. It used to go down to like uh, freaking 50 kilometers an hour and the speed limit's 100 so shouldn't really do that. We'll see how it does. Um, we're gonna loop around over here and we've got a construction zone coming up. This is mostly like a highway test. So if you folks like highway tests, watch this video. It's really good. Uh, it tends to be a little bit boring, but uh, I'll try to mix it up a little bit. Uh, so if you folks like this video, please hit like and please subscribe to my channel. It'll help me a lot. Uh, if you wanna buy a Tesla, I've got a link to my referral down at the bottom of the video. It'll help me a lot if you guys do buy a Tesla and use my referral link or anything, even if you wanna do a demo drive. Picks the right exit over here and does very well. Um, with that, let's see how it goes. I'm really interested to see how slow it's gonna go on this uh, turn, for example, because we've got a loop that's going on, uh, that's going on right now. A little bit too fast for my liking. Oof! Does pick the left? Ah, yeah, that's that's a little bit too close for my liking. Like if the weather conditions were worse, I wouldn't have let this do it. But we are in a thaw period right now. Okay. <laughs> scary bit um, so we've got a merge not, not a merge kind of like a filter lane so we've got our old lane over here going on look at that acceleration that right off the bat insane yeah it gets a little bit hesitant there but does go straight again it does accelerate again goes up to 100 very nice very well done and this is a intense scenario where we've got tr a truck over here tailgating another car and uh, we need to go up to speed. I feel like it's kind of like managing its speed over here just to let these cars in. I am on assertive profile when I add over here. Okay. There we go, we're coming up to a construction zone over here, so it's gonna have to slow down to 80 kilometers an hour. We've got the 80 posted, but we're still slowing down. Car in front of us is braking, so we're gonna brake too. That's uh, well done. And now it sees the 60, and we are slowing down further. But we're still managing our speed within the traffic flow. Oh, it does slow down quite a bit just to let this car through. Oh, look at that. FSD being very polite. That person even waved for me, so there we go. And this is a construction zone, guys, so if you look at the mapping, it's not quite accurate. You can see we're going off from a tangent over here. We'll put back our visualization. This is very exciting. I have, like, I am so happy right now. It's doing so well, and uh, just testing everything and seeing all the improvements. Roundabouts are working well. Merging is doing well. It's letting cars in properly. It's assertive at the same time. Overtakes and takes and goes back. Like so many things that there's a traffic light that used to just it, it used to think it's it's for us, so we had to stop for it. And but it's actually not, and you can go straight ahead. Version 11 for two years I suffered with that. Just blew through it without even without even the slightest hesitancy. It's amazing, like, it's amazing how far they've they've come. And just with a switch of a, oh, and we got the wrong exit over here. All right, we we're saying how good it was, but then picks the wrong, wrong exit. Let's see how it's gonna reroute here. 
I think if we just go straight ahead, it'll be okay. I just let it do what it wants, and it, we gotta go right here to go straight. So let's see. Let's. I'm gonna intervene if it doesn't do that. To be honest, because it's gonna change lanes. Come on, change lanes, buddy. Change lanes, buddy. Where is it supposed to go straight? I have no clue anymore. Yeah, I think I'm gonna disengage here. There we go. Incorrect lane selection. So yeah, this is um, this is fairly. I don't know why that guy's waving his hand. No, nope, we gotta go straight. We gotta go straight. Okay, we gotta go straight. There we go. Incorrect lane selection. Yeah, the, this highway is new, so um, you know I'm gonna I'm gonna forgive it over here. Um, maybe once we do a map update, I'll revisit this highway test. But um, here we go, another filter lane over here, and it should pick up speed. It is 80 actually, so it is the correct speed. And 85 is pushing it to be honest in the construction zone. And once we hit that orange sign over there that says end of. Uh, end of construction we should be good and it's picking the right lane over here we have to go actually left so that we can go straight ahead because that lane is exiting so far so good now this is where it gets a little bit tricky because the speed is 100 over here all the way and there we go you can see it bouncing down to 70 100 it didn't flinch though version 11 used to just slam on the fucking brakes excuse my language it used to slam on the brakes ah uh, 50 we're still doing 97. Let's go! Woo! 50. We're still 95. This is the power of AI. Woohoo! Just because of the automatic speed offset, I knew it's going to do this right. It's still hesitant. Like, it's still slowing down a little bit. It's like, I don't really know if I should go down. Oh, don't go. Don't do it. All right. So, if there's more cars around us, it wouldn't. Even, like, kind of pushing it up. Let's wait for this car to pass by. There's a car passing by right from behind us. That car. And then it should should set the speed right. Come on, buddy. Go go faster. Oh, no. Come on. You got to go faster. Let me give it a punch. Let me give it a punch. Come on. You got to go faster. Oh, man. I really thought they fixed that. Yeah, no. No, it didn't work. Go faster. All the cars are going fast. Well, it's building up speed again. Okay, it's building up speed again. I'm not doing anything. I just gave it a punch a few times. We gotta go straight. Don't go right over here. Yeah, it's going faster now. We've got a car behind us too. It does say 70, but once it goes down to 50, it gets a little bit doubtful about itself. 99, 100, very good. Still thinks it's 70 though. 100. Yeah, and then it's gonna go down to 50 again over here. There's another segment. All right, so it's not too bad. It's, it's kind of like when I scroll up the the speed, it doesn't really do anything. I wish it just takes that as a hint because I don't want to press the accelerator every time okay move my leg from the accelerator pedal I just don't want it to phantom brake and now we're coming up to a fork on the on the highway there we go just as I was saying that just fix the right lane very good job FSD well okay you don't have to go okay I guess you can go to the right lane we are doing a hundred only, and, and people tend to go over a hundred here. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Very good, very good. So happy with this update. I can actually drive on this highway with autopilot right now, or FSD. Sick. Okay, I'll speed you up here to the next exit coming up, unless something else happens. Okay, so we are entering here a slight construction zone area, and uh, we've got a posted speed limit of 80. And our lane's ending over here, so it should 
be able to see this from far away. Come on, buddy. We are driving faster, though. Ugh, I hate this. Okay, so it's signaling now. It's a little bit too far for it to do that, so... And it is going down to 80, so... It seems like it depends a lot on the cars around it in these situations, like speed lim auto speed limit and, uh, and construction zones. Okay, I'll speed you up again over here because we got an exit coming up soon. All right, here we go. So we've got an incoming lane from the right and we are supposed to take this exit right away coming up here at 900 meters. So let's see how it does. Now it has to change lanes actually to the right. We don't have any cars next to us or on our shoulder, so we should be okay. And it's indicator right away and a smooth exit. So yeah, this was a little bit easier than uh, the usual, but um, if we do encounter a car next to us, it would have been a little bit more challenging but we'll, uh, we'll save that for next time. So if there's any improvements on this road, I am going to post another video about it. So thanks everyone for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Hope you folks have a nice day. There is a tiny roundabout coming up right ahead, and I'm just gonna show you how it does that, but we are going right, so it's going to be an easy one. If you guys wanna watch it, you can still watch it, and please don't forget to hit like, and please subscribe to my YouTube channel as well, and uh, use my referral link if you wanna buy a Tesla, or if even you wanna go for a test drive, with FSD, you can uh, book your demo through my preferred link as well, and it'll give me some points and it'll support me and my channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Should check for its shoulder over here, visibility, it's okay, that car next to us is driving through, so I would have done the same thing. Excellent, very good. I'm so happy with this, it's actually usable right now. Thanks folks for watching, and we'll see you next one. Have a nice day.